important issue as constitution. Imenti Central Member of Parliament Gitobu Imanyara was the first to raise the matter on the floor of the House, which sparked off heated debate in Parliament in the afternoon. The subject matter, the criteria used to appoint Court of Appeal Judge Lady Justice Kalpana Rawal to head the probe team. His Excellency the President did indicate that there will be a thorough, fair and impartial investigation of the circumstances that uh, uh, led to the death of our uh, two colleagues. And then immediately thereafter, Mr. Speaker, the Minister for Transport purported to make an announcement under which he appointed a member of the executive to sit in an investigation of the incident. Contrary to the provisions, Mr. Speaker, of usage, uh, constitutional practice here, and also the principles set out in the law regarding the setting up of commissions uh, the, uh, of inquest. Appellate Judge Kalpana Rawal was appointed to head a five-member committee tasked with probing the early Sunday morning tragic helicopter crash that saw the lives of six Kenyans, including Internal Security Minister Professor George Saitoti and his assistant Ora Ojode, taken. But according to some members of parliament, protocol was not observed in the appointment, seeing that the judiciary is an independent institution that is also overwhelmed with a backlog of cases. I wish to support that point of order, especially the part that relates to appointment of a serving member of the judiciary without perhaps consulting the Chief Justice. When you respect separation of powers, the executive does not choose for itself which judicial member will be a member of the committee. They request the judiciary and the judiciary gives a person. Mr. Speaker, I can respond to those issues now. What is it, Member Mr. Speaker, I was very clear uh, to whom I was directing my request. Is the Honorable Attorney General as a legal advisor of the government because there are constitutional issues uh, involved. And Mr. Speaker, this minister is an interested party. Attorney General Professor Gidho Mwigai is expected to table a ministerial statement on the matter Thursday. Evelyn Wamboi, Citizen Live at 9.